Yo, what is good with y'all? I'm back with day two of consistent YouTube posts. Oh my god, bro. Oh, hell no, man. What the fuck, man? No, but for real, today I'm about to give you all the sauce. I'm about to show you how I made this uh, night vision kind of opium looking effect. And uh, yeah, let's just get straight into it. Uh, first thing you're gonna want to do is find your clip you want to put the effects on. And me personally, I got these two clips. And here's what it looks like uh, raw without any effects. So before we get into it, you can either follow along and I'm gonna show you how I added all these effects and what settings I keep them on. Or you could head to my website, lurkingvisuals.store, where I just posted this opium style pack where you get uh, 10 different presets. Um, and this effect is actually from that pack. And a bunch of other effects. Uh, including this title that I just used for this music video that I shot so if you feel like checking that out go ahead and do that but let's get into it so after you found your clip that you want to use for this effect you're gonna want to add the first effect which is called Gaussian blur this effect I keep at 3.5 and make sure to have repeat edge pixels on and next thing you're gonna want to add is the fast box blur and this effect I keep on maybe 1.5 or maybe 2 depending on a clip and uh, also make sure to have repeat edge pixels and horizontal and vertical for both these effects and let's add an unsharp mask and this effect I keep on 80 with a radius of four and this effect you're gonna want to add is a grain uh, which i'll keep on maybe four oh no that's too much let's keep it on 0 0.2 just to add a little effect and we can put the viewing mode to final output and yeah i think that's that's good and the next effect you're gonna want to add is a wave warp uh, which I keep on 4 at the height and the speed also on 4 and change the wave type to smooth noise and after that let's add a solid composite and let's change the color to this dark greenish color to give a, a kind of night vision look and here's what it looks like so far I think that's good and next effect you're gonna want to add is a minimax and let's change the radius, radius 1 yeah I think that's good and then let's add some noise uh, like that and let's change this to 20 see now we're getting somewhere and let's add some Venetian lines too and let's change this to I don't know six maybe seven depending on the clip and then the direction to 90 degrees and let's lower the width and feather yeah one and then let's add a curve and uh, the famous s curve like that or maybe yeah something like that depending on the clip I kind of like where it's uh, when it's kind of dark but not too much and let's add a hue saturation to lower down the saturation to yeah somewhere around 60 maybe that's good and then let's add this one effect that I don't even know how to pronounce but it kind of sells the effect with this one so to sell this effect if you have sapphire you can use jpeg damage uh, sapphire isn't free but i recommend you actually go and get it because i use it in almost all of my videos i'm not sponsored though but sapphire give me some money yes! and that's how i made this effect so if you're interested you can head to my website lurkingvisuals.store where i just dropped uh, this opium style pack where you get 10 different presets um, with some sick uh, opium style effects. I actually made this title with the pack 
uh, for this music video I just shot and uh, yeah if you're interested go check that out if you use the code open you get five dollars off and the pack is like 30 bucks so you get it for 25 I think that's that's a steal in my opinion but yeah that's it